Hi guys, good morning. This is Ko and I am coming to you <coughs> sorry with another video and today's video will be a brush collection video. I'm kind of a brush fanatic and um so if you follow me on Instagram then you'd have seen or on Twitter you'd know that last Sunday I washed 150 brushes. Yeah, I said it, 150. These were all just ones I had used in a like two to three week period that I decided, listen, I ain't washing y'all today. And I do spot clean, but I usually don't spot clean more than one time. So I have a little thing that I tend to drop brushes in. I use them once and just put them in there so they pile up. And I, I kind of don't mind washing brushes, but then again, I have a girlfriend named Dawn, and she's awesome with washing brushes, I tell you. So, that being said, I was asked via Instagram and my YouTube inbox to do a brush collection video. So this will be a brush collection video, and you'll get an overview of the top of my desk. This video will not be edited because I haven't figured out how to edit on my iPad number one, which I've been using to film lately. And number two, I'm using my cell phone today. So it will be just a direct upload. So for you people who love to edit stuff, sorry. Anywho, let me turn you guys around and start with the brush collection thingy, okay? So here we go. Right in front of me are the brushes I used this morning. These would be the dirty brushes. And they pretty much, as you can see, I have different brands. Some of them are no-name brands. This one's from eBay. That's Tila. This is... Um, Who's this? Sigma? No, that's Coastal Sense, and this one is Sigma. So, this one is a no-name brand I got in Walmart, So, and this is Real Techniques. I'm not partial. So, up here, I got this container at the container store, and as you can see, these are like the short brushes, the short-handled brushes, the mini-mac brushes, different types. As I said, I'm not brush partial. I will buy a brush from every brand, one of each possibly, just to try it and see if I like it. And those are short brushes, mini brushes. This is a Kabuki brush from EcoTools. I love, love, love this brush. That is a must-have for makeup setting. Um... Hey, look at my fat tummy. Well, yeah. Kind of got... Hmm, anyway, whatever. It's about the brushes. So here, I pulled out... I reorganized my area very recently. And so on top, I did go back and pull out my e.l.f. brush organizer. And this has three sections. So on one side here... I have all these detailing brushes. I am not, cannot, will not go through them individually because that would be just too much time. So as you can see, here is also a mixture of different brands and all the different things that they do. There are concealer brushes, they are powder, um, shading brushes, there are synthetic brushes, this one's from Sigma. Um, Real Techniques again, Walmart brushes, Rock and Republic brushes, uh, Sony Akashic brushes, Elf brushes, um, hmm, more Sony Akashic brushes, Elf brush again. So you get the idea. This one is a brush I got from Michaels, the craft store, and I got this one to blend my crease. So in the middle, right here, I chose to put most my foundation brushes. 
These are what the ones I use for foundation. And they're, again, they're different brands. There's Sigma, there's Coastal Sense, there's uh, Walmart brushes. Um, yeah, so those are on top there. And next to those is another section that has all more detailed brushes. Just like the other side over here. Yeah. So here you have more detailing brushes, pencil brushes, and the like. Right here in a separate container, it's just a, a picture holder thingy. And I have it stuffed. If I take it up, there it is. I just have it stuffed with different brushes, with various brushes. There. It's just like chock full of brushes, different sizes, different companies, different shapes. Um, huh. And I don't know how many in there. I just stuffed them in there all. Hmm. Okay. And if I pick this one up, you can see it's one hand. Those are all the brushes that are in the e.l.f. thingy. It's kind of heavy. And there's no filler on the bottom. You know, some people like to put filler on the bottom to um, stand the brushes up. I threw out those a long, long time ago. So everybody's just on their own, just standing in there next to each other, and they stay perfectly fine. Okay, so those are the ones that are out and are pretty much used in rotation weekly per se. Now, let me, I'm reaching under my desk. Oh my gosh. So here, I have more brushes. And excuse a little bit of shakiness. Stack that one here. In this, I have just a few more um, the Real Technique brushes. I kind of took them out and put them over there. So this really houses all my Real Technique brushes. This one, the case is from Real Techniques, this little black case. When you buy a set from Real Techniques, you get this little black case. Okay. So... Inside the second case are all my MAC brushes. See, I have foundation brush, that one, the 130, 109, 224, whatever these are. Can't remember the names, Don't ain't going to look at them. So those are all my MAC brushes right there. Okay? And this guy is, this one is a Coastal Sense 22-piece brush set. And there are one, two, three, four missing because I have them up in that thingy over there. And these are the ones that are in here. Okay? I've never used the fan brush. I have one of these already that came on its own, and I love, love, love this brush, so this one is a backup. I have not touched it. This one is so soft and nice, but I yet I haven't used it, but this would be awesome for foundation application or powder, cream or liquid. Cream, liquid, or powder, that would be good. Whoops. Running out of time here, guys, so pretty much that's it. I have 50 seconds to go, so foundation, blush, and all that good stuff, and thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. And that is essentially my brush collection. So that's an overview of my brush collection, and there it is. I love brushes, and I have another set coming in via um, Sephora. I bought the Pantone set, so when that comes in, I'll make sure I show it to you guys as well. So 12 seconds to go. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you for watching, and have a great day. And if you love brushes, thumbs up the video. Bye.